If you were a fan of Two and a Half Men, then you probably enjoyed the hilarious jokes, the funny situations, and of course, the talented actors Charlie Sheen, John Cryer, Angus T. Jones, and later on, Ashton Kutcher. But if it was just these four gentlemen on screen, the show would probably have gotten quite boring quite fast. Fortunately, the producers of Two and a Half Men knew there needed to be some serious talent, acting talent and otherwise, on the screen opposite the men to make the series really pop. Facts First presents all the sizzling women of the Two and a Half Men cast. Megan Fox The stunning Megan Fox has been wowing audiences with her good looks and flawless smile for years with a breakout turn in Transformers, so she naturally turned heads as she portrayed Berta's granddaughter Prudence on Two and a Half Men. It likely wasn't a huge surprise watching as both Charlie and Alan went gaga over Prudence. After all, not many men can resist Megan in real life, so why should these sitcom characters be any different? The plot dictated that both men realized the potential fallout from falling for Prudence, so they stopped chasing after after her. But that, of course, led to Jake falling head over heels for Prudence and deciding he'd follow her around wherever she went. Sadly for fans of Megan, we didn't get to see more of her after this memorable guest spot. Denise Richards if you're familiar with Denise Richards, then you know she has a long history with one of the show's stars, Charlie Sheen. So it came as no surprise when Denise began to pop up across several episodes. She played Lisa, a woman who gets together with Charlie for most of season one. Sadly, they ultimately broke up due to Charlie having commitment issues. This was perhaps a telling sign of things to come in real life, but that's probably for a different video. But season one isn't the last time we see Lisa. She arrives back on the scene in season two, revealing to Charlie she's now engaged. And because this is a sitcom, instead of reacting like a normal person, Charlie decides to totally pretend he's a changed man to win her back. He's somewhat successful in that Lisa decides to break things off with her fiancé. But then the two of them split again for familiar reasons. Richards is of course known as a prominent and beautiful actress who's had a multitude of roles over the years, including in Starship Troopers and the James Bond movie The World Is Not Enough. She's also been in classic shows like Friends and Seinfeld. In more recent years, she's been a prominent figure in the reality show world even getting her own one called Denise Richards, It's Complicated. Brooke Shields Brooke Shields has been a successful actress since she was a teen. She starred in movies like The Blue Lagoon and had a successful modeling career as a youngster as well. She's also one of those rare actors who managed to have huge success as a child, managed to survive the rigors of Hollywood, and come out as a well-adjusted adult. Not only that, but she's had an even bigger career as an adult than she did as a child star. She joined Two and a Half Men for season four, playing Danielle Stewart. Danielle was a neighbor to the Harpers, and naturally both Charlie and Alan managed to fall in love with her. At first, she decides to date Alan. This is because she's hoping his more down-to-earth personality will be the cure for her wild and rambunctious tendencies, which have burned her in the past. Of course, this rambunctious side is exactly what Charlie is into. So he decides to step in and argue with Alan over which one of them deserves to date her. Not surprisingly, Danielle ends up taking a pass on both brothers. In recent years, Brooke Shields has appeared in TV shows like Law & Order and Army Wives, as well as in movies like The Other Guys and Furry Vengeance. Stephanie Jacobson this gorgeous actress graced the screen of Two and a Half Men in the ninth season. She appeared as a girl in a bikini who came looking for Charlie, and she looked stunning as she did. Stephanie brings an international aspect to the show as she was born in Hong Kong in 1980. Some of her most notable credits are roles in Alex Cross, Terminator, The Sarah Connor Chronicles, and Battlestar Galactica Razor in 2007. J.J. Snyder J.J. Snyder wowed audiences with her appearance in Season 8 of the show. She appeared in Episode 13 playing a woman named Terry. Born in 1972, J.J. also appeared in another classic multicam sitcom, Two Broke Girls. She was also in 2010's On the Red Carpet, as well as America's Most Wanted, America Fights. This video is brought to you by Vite Ramen. Vite Ramen is a small family-owned business crafting high-protein ramen in small batches here in the U.S. Their dream is to make it so everyone can eat healthy, no matter what challenges a person faces. And with Vite Ramen, you're never too busy to eat healthy. It's easy to make and only takes three minutes. So in just a few minutes, you have a super meal that tastes great and is actually good for you. Vite Ramen is a full meal, not the tiny packets that leave you hungry after an hour. It keeps you full for hours because of its nutritional density, high protein, and high fiber. Our favorite flavor is chicken. We love how quickly this meal comes together and can't get over how great it tastes. Click the link below to get a bundle that gives you $25 in value of free gifts and free shipping in the contiguous U.S. And don't forget to use my code FAXFIRST at checkout for an additional 10% off. 
That's viteramen.com slash Faxverse, or just click the link below and use the code Faxverse. Anna Easton. Anna Easton showed her stuff in Season 8 as well in the same episode that J.J. Snyder appeared in. She played a character named Wanda. Anna is another actress who brought an international flair to the show as she was born in Finland to a Finnish farming family. But she became a successful model and received a big modeling contract from a Japanese agency when she was a teen. She then added acting to her list of talents and moved to L.A. Some other notable credits of Anna's include roles on Bones and Days of Our Lives, as well as Who Wants to Be a Superhero. She was also the host of the Finnish version of the Fox show Wipeout, and she looked flawless when she appeared on Two and a Half Men. Valerie M. Ortiz Valerie graced the screen in the show in Season 8. She played Hot Girl at the Bar in Episode 12. And while the producers didn't see fit to give her character a name, we're sure she was a lovely person with a full life. Valerie was born in Puerto Rico, but spent her childhood in Orlando, Florida. She was a dancer as a youngster and then added in stage acting as she grew older. She attended the University of Central Florida. She started out in the hosting world, working for the Nickelodeon show Splat, as well as LA TV Live in Los Angeles. She then played Jello in the movie Date Movie, where her character was a J-Lo impersonator. Her other credits include roles in Hit the Floor, South of Nowhere, and Gabby Duran and the Unsittables. Desi Lydic Fans of The Daily Show will certainly be familiar with this beautiful and funny actress. She appeared in Season 8, playing Veronica in Episode 12. Lydic is originally from Louisville, born in 1981. She's been a correspondent for several years for The Daily Show, getting to show off her comedic chops to go along with her gorgeous looks. In addition to Two and a Half Men, she's also appeared in productions like Awkward and We Bought a Zoo. She got married to her husband, actor Gannon Brousseau, in 2014, and they have one child together. Diora Baird Diora Baird appeared in an episode of the show in the sixth season. She played Wanda in episode 16. Originally from Miami, Baird is a successful actress and model. After moving to LA at age 17, she found success at first as a model, appearing in a guest clothing campaign and gracing the pages of Maxim Magazine's Hot 100 lists in 2007 and 2008. She was also on the cover of Playboy in 2005. She has a slew of acting credits to her name, including roles in Cobra Kai, Wedding Crashers, and the Texas Chain saw Massacre. Emily Rose Emily Rose appeared on the show as Janine in the 12th episode of Season 6. She's perhaps best known for her role as Audrey Parker from Haven, a show on sci-fi. That and her role as Elena Fisher in the PlayStation series of games called Uncharted. But she's also graced the screens of shows like Cold Case, Brothers and Sisters, as well as Ghost Whisperers. Now it's time to hear from you. Did we miss any of your favorite sexy guest stars on Two and a Half Men? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.